Hi, this is Drew from Show Me Cables, and in this video I'm going to show you how to terminate a CAT6 dual row jack. The materials needed for the installation are CAT6 cable, a CAT6 dual row jack, a punch down tool, technician scissors, and a cable stripper. The first step is to strip back the jacket of the cable. Simply rotate the strip tool around the outside of the jacket. This slices it and makes it easy to pull off. On the inside, you'll find a piece of string and four twisted color-coded pairs and a spline in the middle. Spread out the four color-coded pairs and cut the spline at the base. Then, you'll find a piece of string. Cut that off with your technician scissors. Then, untwist the four color-coded pairs so you'll end up with eight conductors or eight wires. Once you have the pairs fanned out, lay them on the IDC connector on the back of the jack in the appropriate color code. The color code is printed on the jack for reference. You'll notice that each conductor has a color, orange, orange-white, green, green-white, etc. Match the color conductors to the color code and place in the appropriate IDC slot. For most applications, choose the 568B color code. Once you have laid out the conductors to the right color code, take your impact tool and punch down the conductors. The punch down tool pushes down the conductors into the IDC slot and also removes extra wire. Here's a properly installed CAT6 dual row jack. The last step is to push on the stuffer cap to protect the conductors and ensure you will not lose connection. You have now terminated a CAT6 dual row jack.